Hey Droners, Julian here. Today we're gonna to be talking about the advantages of having a VTOL, fixed wing, and a multi-copter. If you guys consider subscribing and liking the video, it really helps. Uh, we're gonna start talking about multi-copters. So multi-copters, usually you think about the four rotor configuration. Now they come in different variants. For example, the coaxials, which is usually a eight motor configuration, one on top of the other one. We have uh, hexacopters, we have quadcopters, that's what we usually call this configuration. The main characteristics of a multicopter, it's super stable in winds, especially high winds. Now, there are some configurations that may be different, but usually multicopters can take off really quick up in the air. Uh, they're easy to assemble, easy to, to fly, and you can get closer to your objectives. So for example, if you're doing an inspection under a bridge close to power lines, close to uh, communication towers. So that's the main advantage of having a multicopter. You can fly closer to your objectives and they can deal and be more stable in a high wind condition. Another key feature of a multicopter is the ease of operation. So companies like DJI, for example, have done a great uh, solution for it. It's super user-friendly. You take off, something happens, you just let go of the controllers, it just stops in place. Now that's a great advantage of having a multicopter because compared to fixed wings, they take more area to stop. So we'll talk about that in a minute. But multicopters, just keep in mind, easier of use, faster deployment times, and also you can get closer to your objectives. When we talk about fixed wings, we're talking about the airplane style of drones, usually a lot of people tend to confuse drones in general. Now, we have fixed wings and VTOLs. Now, VTOLs will be a fixed wing that has a configuration of a multi-copter built into it in terms. So you will have, like, for example, the Dragonfish has multi-copter uh, motors to take off, and that's what the word means. VTOL is vertical takeoff and landing. So you're taking off vertically, then uh, switching into a fixed wing mode, and then just fly in a forward motion and then when you're ready to land it will come to a halt or stop and then just hover in place and land on the same spot. The main advantage of having a fixed wing especially on a VTOL configuration is you can take off on a really small area so you don't need a runway or anything you can have depending on your system you can have a 40 foot by 40 foot landing uh, area and then you can take off from there once you're clear of all your obstacles you can do your, your transition into fixed wing uh, mode. Having a, a VTOL fixed wing is beneficial not only because you can take off, but also you can cover more area. Now, that's the main advantage of a fixed wing over a multicopter. Now, multicopters, the way they work is all four motors are creating thrust to lift its weight. Now, it may be more stable, yes, but all those four motors, or six or eight, depending on your configuration, can decrease your flight times. Now, that's why you have multi-copters ranging between 30 minutes, 40 minutes, up to 50 minutes, depending on configurations. Now, on fixed wings, we have an, a bigger advantage in terms of coverage and flight times. Now, when you are in fixed wing mode and you're flying, you get m lift from the wings. So that motors have to work l less, it's just to help the, the fixed wing move through the air and then we get more area and more flight times. Uh, one thing you can do with both platforms is, for example, we're just gonna cover something as simple as mapping. Now, mapping in both uh, platforms is very different. With one, you're flying slow, you can fly lower. Depending on your configuration and sensors, you can get better resolution uh, results from a multi-copter as to the uh, fixed wind has to fly faster now. Don't get me wrong, you have sensors, you can adjust parameters to get really good results with fixed wings. The real key advantage of a fixed wing is you can cover more area. And we're talking about three, four times the area that you can cover with a multi-copter. Fixed wings can also be really easy to use. The one thing that you have to be uh, really careful about is your obstacles, your altitudes, you know, please check all your safety parameters before you fly. Now your wind speeds is really important. Now even though they come with built-in mechanisms to detect the airspeed uh, and then figure out if it's, you're flying into, and you know, in high winds and it's not safe, but 
as, an, as a pilot, as an operator, you should be able to check your safety before you fly, but they're super easy to fly. If you, something goes wrong, you can hit return to home, they will come home safely. You can set uh, parameters for safe return to home so you avoid obstacles in, in a particular area. Uh, so they're pretty safe, they're easy to assemble, put together, they can uh, self-check, they can tell you what's wrong before you fly and you're good to go. Whether it's fixed wings or multi-copters, uh, Droners has the perfect solution for you guys. Check the link down below and you can find the perfect solution for your needs. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.